Hello and welcome to Shooting Range. Maybe the running in NTSC message on Sony cameras is a thing to you. Or you just thought about buying a grey imported Sony camera but were afraid of the lack of languages. Then this video is the right thing for you. I show you how to use the open memories tweak for your Sony camera. I quickly summarize what this can do. Disabling the running in NTSC message if you like to shoot in 24p or 120p, but have no model from an NTSC place in the world. Disable the artificially shortened recording time of 29 minutes and 59 seconds when shooting video. So just the size of your card decides how long you can record. Disable the 5 minute recording limit of 4K video on the RX100 Mark IV. And last but not least, unlock all the available languages for the case you bought a cam that doesn't have your mother language. The whole thing is working with Sony cameras from A6000 or A7 and just doesn't work on the newly released models like A9, A7R Mark III or RX10 Mark IV. You can find a list of all compatible cameras and all the links you need in the video description. That this thing works has to do with Sony using Android as the operating system on their cameras. And Android is capable of installing apps. Unfortunately there is no more Android on the newer models. That's why there wouldn't be such way to unlock these things. And that's why there is no app support. The tweak shown here is no hack. There is nothing done for what the camera isn't made for. It just unlocks hidden menu options. Also the guarantee shouldn't be affected. But it's better to revert all the changes and uninstall the app if you want to send your camera to Sony for warranty repairs. But let's go. What you need is a Mac or Windows PC, a micro USB cable and a little download from this website here. At first you start the download from the website. Then turn on your camera and connect it to the PC. Open the downloaded file and click on get camera info. Down in the status window you should see the model and firmware of your camera. In this example it is an A6300 and here an RX100 Mark IV. That means that your connection works. When you hit an error here, you need to try another PC or Mac, another cable or a different USB port. The real work is done in the install tab. That's where you can install apps onto your camera. For now, just the open memory tweak app is important to us. But there are some other useful apps that can be installed from here. When the open memory tweak app is selected, click on install and the tool starts doing its thing. If the installation is complete, you see the info on the status window. Now the app is on your camera and can get opened with the usual app menu on the cam. In the app itself you need to load changes, otherwise the settings will not have any effect. Then you can activate the tweaks. Here on the RX100 Mark IV virtually everything. NTSC warning, 5 minute 4K limit and the recording time. Even if the camera sooner will overheat then record more than 30 minutes. On this model I do not need to activate languages because it's already a German model. That's it. You can close the app with the menu button on your camera and after restart of the camera the new settings are active. Like you can see in the disappeared NTSC warning. I hope this video was useful for you. If yes, leave me a like and subscribe to this channel. Have a great NTSC warning free day.